This is part two for the records I got today, July 19th. Finishing off the 45s, we have, I think, three more left. We have Shout Part 1 and Part 2 by the Asley Brothers. We have Queen's Crazy Little Thing Called Love and Spread Your Wings. And we have Aerosmith, What It Takes and... Monkey on my back. And we have... I don't really know. Mystical. I don't know if you know any of these. And tell me. These are... Rap promo. I only know one of them. Two of them. One of them was produced by Dr. Dre. I don't know. I will take these out, but... Mm -hmm. I'm not too big on rap anymore. Never knew any of these people. We have Hype Sticker. Things like Greatest Hits. Um, promo. So it doesn't show it, but... Yeah. These are all from the 90s. Raise the Roof. I don't know, kind of reminds me of Led Zeppelin right there, but it's not. Break the rules. And all these are mostly just, um, focus. Well, that's not a good example. But here. Respect. This is not Cena Franklin. But it has a Radio Queen. Um, dirty album. Um... Radio Clean album version TV track. That's what most of these are. It's just clean album, dirty and normal. This Rap a Lot Records. Personally, I don't know where all of these came from. Just randomly found them in my papa's garage. These are worth like twenty dollars, not each. Some of these are not worth as much. I think this is the same one as the first one, I'm not sure though. Don't think it is. All these keep falling. Produced by Ski, when you hear Ski A, you might have Ski Mask, which I don't like new rap at all. Here's nope. Never mind this ain't the one produced by Dr. Dre, it's the next one. Personally, I like uh, 90s rapping like Eminem or up and stuff. East Coast slash West Coast killers. And here's the other side. Instrumental, yeah. And then we have Grammy rap nominees 1999. We have names like Buster Rhymes, Lauren Hill, Will Smith, Beastie Boys, uh, Jeppermaine, Dupree, Fujin, Jay-Z, Outkast, Old Dirty Bastard, Big Punisher, and a Tribe Called Quest. This one, you can actually see all the songs on here. You can probably read those if you have better eyesight than me and wear my glasses. But the only song I really recognize is Money in the Bank. But yeah, that's.